Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to the tiny hilltop. Today I am going to finally start planting some trees and some bushes. So I'm excited. This weekend my cousin used his front loader to grab my chips and bring them up top. Helps me a lot, don't have to go as far to grab a wheelbarrow full, especially now that I'll be using them more often. I have everything out here I need. The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start with the little blackberry guys and work my way out. I'm gonna plant the blackberries closer to the big trees just because I think I can get them in there without having to dig a deep hole uh, next to all those roots. Okay, so I had those blackberries in the ground. Now I'm gonna move on to the trees. First couple trees I'm gonna plant are the apricots and the peaches. The apricots, I'm just gonna throw over by where I have my apples from last year. The peaches are supposed to be hardy down to zone four, but I'm slightly skeptical. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to try to make a microclimate. I'm gonna take some landscape fabric I have. I'm moving away from landscape fabric completely where I grow food because I don't want the petro products in touch with my, so my soil uh, for leaching purposes, but also I want my soil to breathe. So instead of just throwing it away or recycling it or giving it away, I'm gonna reuse it and I'm gonna attach it to my fencing in the northwest corner to block the northwest predominant wind in the winter. I'm hoping by blocking that wind, uh, I can create sort of a microclimate for the peaches. We'll see if it works, um, but figured it's better than nothing. I don't add any amendments to the soil. I just try to make sure that uh, the trees planted about the same depth it was at the nursery. And also I try to make sure the grafting joint faces towards the predominant wind, in my case, north, northwest. Other than that, I just throw some cardboard down, throw some mulch down and try to let nature work from there. I've been bitten by quite a few ticks while on earth and tested positive for Lyme on a few different tests or a couple at least. I'm sure it's a, at least a reason why my health is nothing to brag about. So it probably seems counterintuitive to wear sandals in the woods. I, pref I prefer the sandals because I know what's on my feet Last year I found three ticks on me, all on my feet, and I felt them instantly and I was able to brush them off before they went vampire on me. I feel like when I wear boots, I don't know what's on my feet and I'm always worried they're gonna be able to crawl up and I'll have no way of knowing because I won't be able to feel them until it's too late. So that's why I wear sandals. I threw the boots on today because Spiders are a whole different level of creep for me. I don't mind them, but if they start getting on my body, I don't enjoy that. I 
I go through all my cardboard when I get it and I rip all the tape off and tags and glue anything that would have glue in it. I have those trees in the ground and mulched. Planted two, apple, two pears, two plums, one apricot, and three apples, and five blackberries. Um, need to do some blueberries tomorrow and move the ones I have to a different location. But that's it for now. Uh, I'm just gonna go through and water these now and probably call it a day. Thanks for hanging out, I appreciate it. Take it easy. Throw me a like if you want. Catch you next time.